हेलो फ्रेंड वेलकम टू माई इंजीनियरिंग हब दिस इज नेटर चीफ इंजीनियर रवि गुप्ता टुडे वी गॉन्ट टॉक अबाउट स्टैंडर्ड डिस्चार्ज कनेक्शन रेगुलेशन 13 ऑफ मार्पोल 7378 फ्रेंड वी हैव स्टार्टेड द मार्पोल सीरीज इन विच वी आर कवरिंग ईच एंड एवरी टॉपिक ऑफ एनएक्स वन एंड विल गो फ्रॉम एनएक्स वन टू एनएक्स सिक्स सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू वॉच देन प्लीज गो टू प्ले लिस्ट ऑफ द मई इंजीनियरिंग हब और यू कैन वॉच इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स द लिंक सो today we going to talk about standard discharge connection so in today video we'll see what why we require standard discharge connection how this standard discharge connection looks like and what are the dimension requirement of the standard discharge connection friend marine engineering hub is a platform which make video like this which will be beneficial for examination purpose and also for your ship related service so please do subscribe and please do share by your one subscription we get lot of encouragement so please encourage us friend if you want to clear the exam you can join our membership and you can watch the other exclusive video which are yet to be released so friend let's start the today video of standard discharge connection so why we require standard discharge connection so the concept of standard discharge connection came because there are two many ship and if each ship is having own different type of standard flange I means suppose let's take example suppose this is a flange of a one ship having a discharge standard of 215 mm for sludge and bilge now let's take one example now suppose the other ship is having a standard discharge connection of 185 mm so the reception facility need to have different type of flanges size diameter pipeline for different type of ship which is not physically possible so what they have done they have come up with a standard discharge connection requirement in which they have said that if you want to discharge bilge and sludge tank overboard to the reception facility then you should have a standard discharge connection which dimension is mentioned in a marpole so the marpole has given a dimension in regulation 13 that what should be your outside diameter what should be your inside diameter what should be your bore circle diameter and all the specifications so that that when you are going to discharge to a sewage reception facility in that case you should have that much amount of standard discharge connection so what is the regulation why it regulation came so it came for the easy discharge to the regulation facility so the residue from machinery space bilges from the oil residue tank need to be offloaded to the reception facility therefore if there is a standard flange which is available so we require a standard flange how we are going to get the standard flange we are going to get a standard flange by mentioning in the marpole and the marpole will tell to all ship irrespective of their dead weight irrespective of their size to in order to give the sludge and to the sewer they need to have that standard connection okay so at the reception facility end and the ship end the pipe of reception facility can be connected with ship discharge pipeline from residue from machinery space bilge and oil residue to the reception facility so here you can see on board the on the port side and starboard side the standard discharge connection is fitted which is having a diameter of 215 mm means the distance from end to end is 215 mm and they have been provided with a six hole okay six hole and other requirement is what the bolt circle diameter the pcd the bolt circle diameter should be 183 mm after that the flange thickness should be 20 mm the flange thickness should be 20 mm and there should be six bolt six flange bolts with there of 20 mm diameter okay so this is the requirement so now this is the requirement for a standard discharge connection for billion cells same is for also for a sewage like 210 mm four hole so as you can see why this thing have been made this thing have been made so that the sludge the sewage can be given to the port irrespective of the ship size so that it can facilitate easy 
transfer now what it say the outside diameter should be 215 mm the inner diameter should be according to the outside diameter of the pipe but it can have a maximum internal diameter of 125 mm okay the bolt circle diameter pcd should be 183 the slot should be 6 and it should be 22 mm in equidistant slot the flange thickness should be 20 mm and the bolt tendon should be 16 number with a 20 mm diameter in length okay so these are the requirements so if anybody asks you what are the main highlight point you can say so the first thing is the 215 mm you should say after that you should say there should be a six hole and you should say the it can able to hold a pressure of 600 kpa you just should say three string after that if they want to know more you should say it should have a pcd of 183 mm and there should be a flange thickness of 20 mm okay so these are the important highlight you should must say while in the examination so friend in today's video we have learned that why the standard discharge connection requirement was provided and what should be the standard discharge connection diameter and how it is provided so if you like the video then please do subscribe and please do share friend who have watched till now i request to all of you i understand you want to clear your examination very fast and in a crude way so please take the membership i guarantee you will get benefited it's a very nominal fees it's only for the making us encouraged to make the video 